tail up, how are we doing? Right, take three, I am having a mare. Ah, phone's full, I've had to delete some stuff. Ah, oh, nightmare, but welcome to the garden and welcome to the sun. Now we're out here because finally I've got the patio done. I've finally got the fence done. We've been doing this place up eight years. You start your way in and you work your way out, don't you? And I finally got nearly done outside, so I can show you. I don't mind don't mind showing you out here a bit. And the sun's boiling hot. It's lovely. Um, See, so I've just kegged my Idaho Seven Brew One Smaths. That's what's left of it after three takes of out the fermenter. Oh, Fist stops again. I'm going to cry. Hmm. It's nice and fruity. I've got glue all over my hands because I've just broke a, an alley tripod. That I, I've broken two tripods recently. I don't know what's going on there. Tried to glue it, couldn't glue it, got fed up, chucked it in the bin in a paddy. Ah, oh, man. So I'm going to have a beer. I've just, I've just, <laughs> kegging. So I forgot to purge the headspace. I, I started fourth carbon it, forgot to purge it. Because I've been shaking it, I purged it. I wore the beer. I knew I would. I didn't know I would. I knew afterwards I would, and I know, I don't know what I was thinking, but anyway, it is what it is. It is what it is. So I'm going to have a Docks Brewery from Groomsby Hard Graft Session Pale Ale. That's what I'm going to have. Grimsby, so the Grimbarian Brewer is from there. Mr. Matthew Lonsdale and John Denton. Johnny Apples is in that area as well. Talking to Johnny Apples, I have got in uh, Flask Gordon my uh, Bohemian Pilsner. Been in there seven or eight weeks now, so that's ready to go. I'm just finding the time to drop it off. He's about 35 minutes away from me, so I'm going to take it. I'm not going to post it. I've got a little goodie bag for him, and um, I just oh, I can't find time. I've got half an hour to myself now, and uh, it's just a nightmare. I'm just struggling for time, but here's what it is. I will get it to you, I promise. So, in the glass. Ah, oh, looks lovely, doesn't it? Look at that. <laughs> Molly, Molly. Molly's here. She's got a cone off and her legs healed, so she's outside. Absolutely loving it in the lovely weather. Ah, beautiful. Bitter. Bit bitter there. Fruity and bitter. Right, they also do... Um, never say die new world IP at 6%. Hog graft session pale at 4%. And they do a mango verboard mango and lime pale at 5%. I've just had that doing the other three videos. It's really nice and fresh and beautiful in this weather. Absolutely lovely. This is nice. That's what I need. So I say, fence is done. Lovely job. Lovely day. Brewing tomorrow. I'm going to. Uh, so I've got loads of stock in. And I've got loads of hops and loads of grain, and I, I do this, I just buy loads of stuff, and then I end up having to brew something with them, um, instead of, and I've not got what I want when I do a recipe, so my plan is to use some of that up. So I don't know what's going into it. Um, I've just opened a new 25 kilo bag of Marisot. I love it, yeah, but, oh yeah, exciting, like Christmas. Um, so I don't know what hops are gonna go into that, it's just crystal and Marisot. And then I'll use some of my hops up. But I'm going to do a few brews. I'll use some stuff up. It's going to take me a while to use more. And I'm going to order in what I want for a few recipes, I think. I think that's my plan. Um, I've got a new regulator. A Micromatic from the Malt Miller. Now, I've had some cheap ones before. I've had a bit of trouble. So I've spent a bit of money this time. They're not mega cheap. But I've had it a couple of months and it's performing lovely. I like it. I like it a lot. Good service. Um... I've got my second delivery of Harrison's Brewery Beer. Now, this has surprised me. Because I decided to get some Coconut Shy PA, and I'm not a massive coconut fan. And I'm loving it. So I might brew with a bit of coconut at some point. I don't know what happened there. No idea. No idea, but I fancy a bit of that. I fancy a bit of that. Now been a funny old year and it's just got funnier today what is it the 5th of the 8th or the 8th of the 7th of the 8th oh, what is it oh, put it up here I bought a Christmas tree today a real Christmas tree <laughs> and uh, I went to a local garden centre for breakfast this morning and there was two small Christmas trees here look in pots looking a bit tired or oh, there was some 
the pines, was it pines, needles was dropping off and the roots was growing out at the bottom of the pot and they just looked sat in a corner looking a bit sad. So we bought one each and we decided that we was going to plant them in the front, I'm going to plant my house in the front garden, our friends are going to plant theirs. And we've got kid, children about the same age and we're going to have a picture every Christmas of them next to it. The tree's going to grow with Martha and I thought that'd be a nice little thing on it. Every year we're going to decorate it up at Christmas, put some lights on it. Be nice, won't it? <laughs> this is lovely, very nice, nice and refreshing after a busy day, 30, 30 degrees I think it is. I'm Scorchio and Ginger, so not ideal. I think we're about it before the phone runs out of storage again. I'm going to have to delete some apps, I think. The, um, I didn't, trouble is, I did, I keep looking up to see that little little red number in the top because I've done, like I say, it's my, it's my third or fourth video. I've done it three or four times and uh, I, I never noticed it stopped recording. I, I noticed the last time and I thought it just got hot because it was quite warm. Um, <laughs> no idea. I've been doing a bit of videoing today. Um, ready for an upcoming video. Say so brew day tomorrow. I'm going to sit. I'm going to move across into the shade a bit. So I don't get burnt. I'm gonna sit outside, enjoy a bit of peace, chill out a bit, have a couple of beers before I go back to work for a weekend of nights. Just a quick catch up. Thanks. Cheers. Like, subscribe, and hit the bell.